All right, so the easiest way to deploy a Next application is by using Vercel, this thing right here, which is a hosting platform made by the same people who made Next.js. And it allows us to easily sync our deployment with GitHub so that Vercel automatically redeploys our websites whenever we merge a new branch into the main one. And this makes it really easy to update your website and have it automatically deployed each time you do so. So I'm going to show you how to set up that now. First of all, you need to sign up right here. I've already done that, so I'm going to log in. But if you click on sign up, it's going to let you sign up with GitHub, which is what I did. So click on that. And then right here, you're going to see this page. And it might ask you for authentication to link this into your GitHub before you see this page. Just authorize it and then come over here. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is create a new repository for our project. So I'm just calling this Ninja List, and you can set this to be public or private. It doesn't matter. You don't need to read me or anything else. Create that repository. And then what we need to do is copy this thing right here because we need to push our project to this repo. So copy that and then come over here. And in a terminal, we need to say git and then remote add origin and then paste in that address. And that's us just linking up our repo with that repo on GitHub. And then we need to add all of our changes. So I'm gonna say git add. And by the way, if you wanna learn more about Git, definitely check out my playlist here on YouTube. I go over all of this in a load more detail. So anyway, we're adding our changes, then we're committing them. So git commit, um, and we'll just say initial. And then after that, we're going to push this up. So to do that, we can say git, push hyphen u origin main and that's going to push our project up to github so hopefully if i come over here and go to ninja list we should see that project over here and we do now so now it's on github and if we want to deploy it all we need to do is say new project over here and then it's going to ask us to import a git repository now i'm just going to do this one ninja list which is the one we just created and then I'm going to select this one, personal account. And then you don't need to alter any of this, just deploy it. And then hopefully in a minute or so, this will be deployed and we should get a completed message. All right, cool. So now it's all deployed and we can visit this on the web right here. And fingers crossed, this all works. Yep, it does. Ninja listing, click on one of these. Voila. So that's how simple it was to deploy a Next application using Vercel and GitHub. So there we go, my friends. That is Next.js. Hopefully now you're in a good position to go out and make your own applications and maybe take things a little bit further. And in the future, I'll probably create some more advanced tutorials about incremental static regeneration, which allows our server to generate static pages on the fly when we need them. And that's so that dynamic pages don't necessarily need to be rendered at build time. They can be rendered on the server when they are first requested. I'll also probably include a real database rather than using a fake REST API at some point too. So definitely more to come in the future. Stay tuned for those. So then my friends, I really, really hope you've enjoyed this series. And if you have enjoyed it, please don't forget to share, subscribe and like. That really means a lot and it helps out an enormous amount. And if you do want to join the cause and support the channel, you can do by clicking the join button on the channel homepage or underneath the video or right down below. You also get a little cool ninja badge next to your name in the comments for that. And it's 99 pence or cents per month. And I've also created several premium in-depth courses on Udemy. So the first one is Modern JavaScript. The second one is D3 and Firebase. And the third one is Vue.js and Firebase. So if you want to take one of those, all the links with the discounts automatically applied to them are going to be in the video description down below. So again, thanks so much for watching and I'm going to see you in the very next course.